Whether you're avoiding salons in the pandemic or trying to protect your hair from the summer elements or maybe losing your locks from all the pandemic stress, the last year has certainly taken a toll on all of our tresses. So joining us with tips to maintain healthy hair all year long are Tracy Brown and Kenya Beasley of True Balance Hair Care. Good morning, ladies. Thank you so much for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks Thank for you. having us. All right, Kenya, what are some at home hair tips for women that aren't ready to go back to the salon? Uh, the first thing they want to do is make sure they maintain their moisture. And the best way to do that are with masks and hydrating deep conditioners. If you have curly, coarse hair, use something hydrating. But if you have bleached or fragile hair, you want to use a balanced reconstruction. Now, the tricky thing is some of us have extensions, and if you have extensions, you want to keep them hydrated, you want to air dry if you can, and follow up with a serum. It's going to protect your locks and make everybody look. Yeah, you have to remember to take care of your extensions, too, just like you take care of your natural hair, right? Yes. 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 Okay, yes. now let's talk about some women who are experiencing hair loss, especially due to COVID. Any tips for them? You know, when it comes to hair loss um, due to stress and COVID, my advice would be make sure that you are, um, that you're, just make sure that you're getting a lot of protein in and make sure that you're taking some multivitamins, especially D definitely make sure that it has um, iron in it because that's going to help and keep the hair strong. Don't stress, it's not going to last long. Um, just know that um, your hair will come back. It's only going to last up to six to nine months. Do not stress, it is going to come back. Now, is it better to wrap your hair at night or leave it so that your scalp gets air in terms of hair loss? What's best in terms of uh, sleeping at night? The trick is, if some people don't like to cover their hair at night. So if you can use a silk or satin pillowcase, your air and scalp gets to breathe and your hair is not pulling, uh, the, the pillowcase will be pulling moisture from your hair like most cotton products do. So silk or satin pillowcase is the trick. Okay, now summer is almost here, although yesterday it felt like summer is here right now with it being 88 <laughs> degrees. Uh, how do we protect our hair from the sun, chlorine, salt water? How do we keep our hair healthy and moisturized? You would, um, I would say, make sure you use a leave-in conditioner that has sunscreen in it. So, you know, the sun will beat our hair down, dry it out. I would say before you go swimming, make sure you spray some of that leave-in in your hair so that it doesn't soak up the chlorine. Your hair is going to soak up that moisture and block the chlorine, the chlorine when you go swimming. Well, ladies, these were some great tips. Kenya, where can our viewers go to learn more information and to find those tips so that they can keep their hair healthy? Go right to our site. We're truebalancehaircare.com. That's true, no E. Um, and you'll see all those tips there plus some wonderful things.